old man Del Hagen reporting in here just to give you guys some insight in what just went down. That was my first time squatting since November 2nd. November 2nd was my last day squatting. And then after that, I went to the behind the neck push press uh, and I did uh, Zercher for a little bit. And then I went to Wisconsin and I did the uh, deadlift machines and all that good stuff. All that great stuff. Came back here, did uh, some RDLs with the eccentric hooks, then did deadlifts. First time squatting now since beginning of November. I'm talking beginning of November. Today's December 20th, so you know a month and a half, going on two months with no squatting. Now listen guys, here's the deal. That squat that you just saw, those squats with the eccentric hooks, okay? It's a little different than the RDLs, because the RDLs, it's lower to the ground, right? It's in line with your hips and everything. So there's really not too much stability yet, you know, going on, really. You pick it up and it's a very short eccentric, and then boom, you explode through it. But with the squat, you gotta pick it up, you gotta walk. These things are shimmy shimmy, you know, shimmy shimmies. You get it all tight in position. It's a big range of motion. And that right there, guys, it's not about the 495 on the way up. It's about controlling 610 pounds. These hooks, guys, these freaking hooks. Okay, I can tell with these tunes playing right now and how much I'm pushing these hooks. Maybe I'm a salesman for these hooks, but I'm telling you guys, these freaking hooks are life changing. I can tell you wholeheartedly, whole freaking heart of gold that I would not have been able to put 610 pounds on the bar, even feel comfortable with that, period, end of sentence. But because it's all that way, like, oh my God, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, there's no way you come up with that, but it's like, you just, you know it's that tension ain't gonna last. And you just, you hit that point and when that weight's released, your CNS, your nervous system, your freaking body is like, oh my God, you're ready to freaking explode through it. It is unbelievable. These hooks, guys, these eccentric hooks, first day back, I'm handling 610 pounds. Most I've ever done was 600. And uh, I mean, as you guys all said, it was high, it was high. It was definitely high. So here, 610, more weight, controlled, and then released. So it's just like, where do we go from here? You know, six, so go from 620, 630, so it's probably just straight to 640, right? Or just put more weight on the eccentric and less weight coming up. You know what I mean? Because you can overload that eccentric more, but it's, it's about handling it, it's about confidence. It's really about confidence. It's about getting yourself under the weight and being confident with it. I think that's the most important thing for squatting. Right, yeah, it's a, you know, you gotta get stronger, you gotta, you gotta believe that you can explode with this weight. And these hooks, these freaking hooks are the ticket, guys. Because it's like, oh man, this feels really freaking heavy. But you know that that weight can come off and you're gonna explode. And even if it's like, so instance, 495, my first day in two months squatting, first day in almost two months, 495, first day back, like, you know? It wasn't like that before, I had to work up to it. So, geez, geez Louise. I mean, the tunes are off, so I guess the sales pitch is over, huh? These eccentric hooks are unbelievable. First day back in squatting, first day getting myself back under a barbell, 610 pounds, first half of the lift. And then, that thing was, that puppy was slow coming up, and it's just because so much weight, and you're staying tight under that weight. Because if you're, if you're not tight, right, if you got the weight on and it's like folding you over like a taco shell, it's, your squat's gonna be nasty and ugly. So it was slow coming up but my form was, you know, I stayed tight. So that's the test that, it's just exciting things, guys. Just freaking exciting things. It's these hooks, I can't stress these hooks enough. Squat is gonna be stronger than ever. Dell is gonna be stronger than ever. Next test is gonna be on the old bench, right? Get the freaking bench press up for the love of God. 